Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll discuss how to properly store your batteries. As you might know, storing batteries incorrectly is one of the main reasons why batteries can't perform well or die early. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe to learn something new every week. Let's get into it. The first tip is to separate your old and new batteries. The reason for this is because the old batteries usually have higher internal resistance, which causes them to have less capacity than their rated capacity. If you accidentally mix all the new batteries in your device, it might result in a shorter runtime on your device or even battery leakage. It's best to keep new batteries in the original packaging, that way, not only are they well protected, but you also don't have to worry about mixing them up with the old ones. The second thing to remember when storing batteries is to keep them away from any metal objects like coins, screws, paper clips, and other battery terminals. If batteries come into contact with metal, they might short circuit and cause other damages. So don't store batteries with metal objects or in a metal container. A battery storage box is a good way to store your batteries, but if you don't have one, a Ziploc bag or plastic container will do the job just fine. When storing it in a Ziploc bag, you need to make sure to secure loose batteries so that they don't come into contact with each other. You can try to align them like this. and secure them with a rubber band. Or you can cover their positive terminals with a piece of tape. The next tip is to avoid storing batteries in a charger or device. Some chargers and devices might draw power from the batteries even when they are unplugged or turned off. This will eventually cause the batteries to get over discharged and damaged. In addition, the main idea when storing batteries is to not let the terminals come into contact with anything. So it's better to remove them from the charger or devices when storing them. Next is to store the batteries at room temperature, which is around 68 to 72 degrees Fahrenheit or 20 to 22 degrees Celsius and away from direct sunlight. Too high or too low temperature will affect the battery's performance. Keeping an eye on humidity is also important when storing batteries. Humidity can build up both inside and outside the batteries, which leads to impairing quality such as shortened lifespan or leakage. So avoid places like inside the refrigerator, on the ground or in the bathroom where the humidity level is usually high. If you are planning to store rechargeable batteries, knowing what their charge level is for storage can help maximize the storage time. For example, for a lithium iron battery, it's recommended to store at 30% of its capacity, which is about 3.6 volts. Because these types of batteries have a higher internal resistance at full charge and at the end of discharge. For steel lead acid batteries, because of their high self-discharge, we recommend always charging them to full before storage. For more information about battery charging levels during storage, or knowing when to charge or discharge batteries, check out this video up here. Another important note is to keep batteries and battery power devices out of reach of children, especially small batteries like button cell batteries. If swallowed, it can cause serious injury, so it's good practice to store batteries in a higher drawer or location with a locker if you have young kids around. Our last tip is to remember to do regular checkups on your batteries during storage, which is usually around two to six months depending on the battery's self-discharge rate. Charge them up if necessary to prevent over-discharge. And that's it for how to properly store your batteries. We hope you find this video helpful. If you have any questions or video suggestions, please leave them in the comment section down below. Thank you and see you next time.